our planet can be described as a highly dynamic complex system dominated by the interaction of many different processes and components. But what does it mean to deal with a complex system as big as planet Earth? It means that the implication of what happens on Earth, including our actions, could deal to non-linear, unexpected and also unwanted consequences. Every part of this planet plays a role in making Earth the home of billions of life forms, including ourselves and of course our society and our civilization. And one of the most interesting and difficult challenges of science has been trying to understand how the planet works and what consequences our action could have on our future. In 2009, a group of renowned scientists have identified the nine processes that govern the stability and resilience of the Earth system. The set of these boundaries has been defined as the safe operating space for humanity, and crossing them could generate unwanted environmental changes that could compromise the survival of the human societies. Six of these boundaries have been already crossed, and others will be crossed soon. For example, some of the boundaries that we have already crossed are linked to agriculture activities like the integrity of the biosphere and the biogeochemical flows. This doesn't mean that agriculture is bad, it means that we have to fix it, we have to change the way we produce. Being able to change the direction and find a way to live and prosper within the nine planetary boundaries uh, would finally do justice to our fantastic analytical intelligence and forgetting about nonsense suggesting that the solution is to go and live on planet Mars. Not being able to live well on our planet would be the greatest defeat of our intelligence and civilization. The main problems, as always, is to really want to do it. It's not lack of knowledge. We know quite well what we should do. It's mostly lack of collective willpower, a coordination of the actions.